Hello Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your March 2018 general reading. It's a general reading so it will not resonate with each and every Capricorn who views the video, but if it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, <clears throat> let's get started. Okay, so some of my Capricorns, you're waiting for money from a divorce or a settlement or some spousal support or child support. Um, there's also like some court proceedings that you might have to deal with in regards to children. Um, there's some of my Capricorns, you apologized, you made up with maybe a Libra. Um, okay. Yeah, that's all I'm getting. Some of you, yeah, divorce in Sagittarius or some fire sign. Okay. All right. So what's the situation for Capricorn? Advice for Capricorn? What's the energy of the person that Capricorn is coming to the reading for? What's the energy of this person? Okay. And the outcome. The outcome for Capricorn. Bottom of the deck, Ten of Pentacle or Ten of Diamond. Alright, so... Good money, family money, longevity, uh, prosperity, uh, retirement. Um, what you've done over the years in regards to build up to the Ten of Pentacles could be family also. It's someone you have a long-standing relationship with. Could be another Capricorn Virgo Taurus like yourself. All right, the situation is the Queen of Hearts. Um, you may very well have a... Or you may be... The child's mother in a situation... You may be trying to listen to your intuition also. You may be open and ready for love. You may be in love with someone. Uh, it could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. It doesn't have to be, but there is love in a situation. The advice here. Listen to your friends. Let your friends help you. There will be a reliable friend here or relative. Um... Sun, Moon, Rising, uh, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. They offer good advice. And um, their energy. They offer good energy. Listen to your friend or family. So let someone help you. Okay. The energy of the person that you come to the reading for. Ace of Hearts. He had new love, new friendship. Definitely in love with someone. It, it may be new rather new it's not 10 years you know 10 of diamond but you, you possibly want that with them um could be cancer pisces scorpio doesn't have to be could be anyone but somebody's in love the outcome there's a five of diamond wow success in home and marriage a definite change in dynamic for you uh, fives are about change so there's there'll be success in home and marriage as there might have been um, a bit of turmoil or drama in uh, home life and or marriage let's open up the reading a bit to see where we are uh, the queen of hearts can you give us a few cards on the queen of hearts This is a really good reading overall. The Queen of Hearts. Come on. Queen of Hearts. The Hang the Hanged Man. So um this could be a Piscean person that you're in love with. Um doesn't have to be uh, this could be you not telling the person you're in love. You're trying to, you, 
it, you feel like it may be too good to be true. I'm trying to wait for the other shoe to drop here. Um. Okay, Capricorn. So, yes, you could be in love with the Piscean person, or you could just really be questioning uh, how much you love a particular person, or is this going to go well, or waiting for the other shoe to drop, just really going with the flow here, or, or trying to see will this person come around or see things in a different perspective or see you in a different perspective or a different light okay what's the give me one more card for that Ooh. the eight of cups you for some of you you want this person to come back walk back towards you they may have walked away you want them to come back or you want to go back to them Let's see, um, the Jack of Clubs, a reliable friend or family member. That is your advice. Ooh, okay. Temperance in reverse. You, you may need to rely on a friend or family member because you feel like things are out of balance for you. You feel like um, you can no longer wait for a situation. You feel impatient. You feel like it's not getting any better. So you might need to rely on the energy, uh, the words from a friend or a family member. Two of Cups, yeah. Um, maybe in regards to this relationship, you feel like there's no balance here or you're not getting exactly what you want fast enough um yeah you might have to rely on friend friendly <laughs> family or friends right friendlies both right um it still looks good um also, some of you may have to rely on family or friend for, for money. Um, just to hold you over. You're waiting for something. The Ace of Hearts for your partner. Um, new love, new friendship. They're in love with you or, or vice versa or both. The Queen of Wands in reverse. The Page of Swords. You may feel like this person, they want to rekindle something with you or vice versa. You did with them. They still may be out getting a lot of attention, uh, doing exactly what they want. They may be after whatever it is they want. This could be a Sagittarius person um, who is just doing whatever they want, however they want to do it. You may need to gather a little bit more information in regards to um, this person. But the outcome is success in home and marriage. Also could say there could be success in home and marriage, but you, you feel a lack of confidence here. Because there, there's something that's shifted, has changed. Uh, keep your eye on this fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Nine 
Knight of Swords. Yeah. You may give your or you may receive some truth. Strength card. Somebody may be confrontational. Or coming to you. You may have to go to this person and, and speak your truth, your peace about how you feel about the relationship. Because it's going to take strength to get through this. It's going to take that inner strength to get over everything that happened in the past to reestablish or, or establish the Four of Wands type of relationship here. Uh, this is not an easy relationship, especially if this is someone that you have history with or you know their history or you know that they get a lot of attention or whatnot. Um, yeah, let's see. We're going to do some butterfly oracle cards for my Capricorn. It looks like there will be success. You just need to speak your truth. You need to be clear and concise in, in your um, with your words. In your words, um, some of you feel like you're not getting what you want fast enough, or someone's not doing what you want them to do fast enough. Um, also, investigate, get, gather more information about. Um, a particular person that has come back around or wants to rekindle or restart or renew um, or get information about the person that you're in a relationship with are they really there because they want to be there or are they there out of obligation leaving get some rest new exercise program windfall nice moving all right, so somebody is definitely moving, leaving, moving. It could be a home move. It could be um, a proverbial move away from a particular mindset, um, moving away from a particular person energetically. Um, get some rest, new exercise, windfall. There might be some money and good luck coming in, good fortune coming in for you. I do see that like you can have longevity with somebody. You can have success here. You may have to leave that old mindset behind. Like I said, it's going to take strength to move forward, to press forward. Um, let's get three cards of advice for Capricorn. A, a, yeah, it, this reading is is predominantly about stress. I'm not stress, but strength. It could be about stress too. Strength to move something forward. Y you're used to being in charge and control of how the situation goes, but you're gonna have to take a back seat because you don't control people. When you try to, um, some some people walk away. Capricorn. It's about having. Um, <clears throat> in unspoken control right not a spoken control but in unspoken control that unspoken control is when a person knows intuitively energetically instinct instinctively that um you know i need to do this for capricorn or i need to do this surrounding capricorn or about capricorn because I just know them. That's that unspoken control. That, that's more so regard and respect. And that's what you want to always be going after versus control, whether it's physical or mental. Um, you don't want that. You want respect and regard because if I respect you, if I hold you in high esteem or high regard, I'm not going to do certain things or I am going to do certain things. So what you should be going after 
this regard and making sure that you have that in this established relationship because or or the reestablishment of a relationship because that's really what's going to move things forward and keep you there um three cards page of swords get more information get more information do your due diligence about maybe someone wanting to come back around to, to you um about someone saying that they're not you know promiscuous anymore they're not out in the streets or it's only just you two of cups yeah get more information in regards to this what could be a successful relationship the high priestess because you have an inner knowing that um you have a spiritual knowing that this is a spiritual bond that you guys have both made the decision to be together but make sure that this person is willing to put the work energy effort time have the strength to move us forward lots of eights here strength 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 if this reading resonated with you for you go ahead and click that like button um this overall is a really good reading it's just about you having history with somebody it might not be such a good history or you know their history and but you guys have made the choice to move forward how does it look moving forward okay so um anyhow i'm not doing extended readings this month but you can partake in the five dollar yes or no reading um it's a yes or no question uh, are we going to be together um should i continue putting energy and effort into this relationship is this person uh, promiscuous is this person cheating uh am i the only one yes or no questions uh anything outside of that your money will be refunded to you um if you can't break it down to a yes or no question okay capricorn know that i am praying for you pray for me as well take care guys